Hey guys, welcome to the first episode of Jville Chronicles. We're underneath Beach Boulevard Bridge. It's really windy today. Uh, I got my back to the wind, so hopefully the audio won't be too bad for you guys. That's what we're using today. Mike Buka Bullshed, six inch, slow sinking. Hooked up, guys. We're hooked up. Didn't have the camera running, but we are hooked up. Heck yeah! There we go, guys. First one of the day on the Mike Buka bullshit. So all this is, is a deep little retention slash overflow pond that they built when they built the second bridge here. So what it does is when it rains, all the, the rainwater comes off the bridge into this pond. And then when this pond fills up too much, there's three drains down there that allow it to drain out into the river. And then when the river floods, like on a super high tide, or during a storm or something, it can actually push water into here. It's a neat little pond. It's actually a brackish water pond, so there are some redfish in here and trout and flounder and stuff like that, but not very many, and it's pretty rare. Oh, we're hooked up again, guys. Of course, I didn't have the camera running. go again guys another one on the Mike Buka bullshad not a bad little one maybe a pound and a quarter pound and a half
my god guys it happened again of course as soon as I turn off the camera I get another one and it's a freaking monster oh my god oh my god and I don't have a scale that's okay cuz I know it's not my biggest bass but oh my god on the mic buka look at that monster on the mic buka That is a beast, guys. It's easily a five pounder. Easily. Sweet. Flyers. Well, this fish was not coming off. Sick. Awesome fish. Might try and get one more picture because I was having a hard time with the bait in the mouth. There. What was that? Alright guys, get a good release on this girl, and there she goes, sick, oh my god guys, oh I just came off, I was about to say it happened again, I just need to leave this camera running, oh, well, three for four is not bad, that was a small one, I saw it, I still would have liked to have caught it, but, that's the game we play. Of course. Now I'm not going to get a hit. It's almost like I've got to turn the camera off or they won't they won't hit. They're camera shy, guys. I don't know. Alright folks, that's the end of the video. We didn't get anything else, but that's pretty successful for a heavily pressured neighborhood pond like this. Sorry for the audio. I'm sure it's going to be super windy like right now as I'm trying to shoot the outro. So just to let you know what I was using today, I was using an old Shimano Corrado 300 DSV, a Kistler Magnesium 2, heavy action, moderate fast, rated for 10 for a 20 to 50 pound line, one to three ounces, so perfect for throwing these little Mike Buka bull shads and bull gills. All right, guys, catch you later. Have fun, tight lines.